The recent town hall meeting moderated by George Stephanopoulos and the assessment that it turned out very poorly for Trump because he failed to properly address the questions that were directed at him and because he came across as anything from disconnected to totally delusional is in part astrologically due to the pressure from so many major planets. But here I want to focus on the role of Jupiter, which in Trump's chart is the great benefactor, the one that has enabled him to get away with everything in his life up to now. There is no doubt this planet is super strong in his natal chart, being in an almost exact station and trining his sun Uranus moon nodes. However, it is not problem free. And once you see the squares to the 12th house planets, you begin to understand the bragging, bombast, exaggeration, and constant expression of total and complete confidence. The problem is that during this month it is stationary square his natal Jupiter, and this means the excess expansion of Jupiter is going to be intensely emphasized. This means his already unreasonable level of confidence is magnified even further and leads him into taking on tasks that he thinks are no problem, he's Trump after all, and the solution to everything is more Trump. Then he discovers that once he steps outside the Fox News cocoon, the questions get a lot tougher, translation, real, and he stumbles badly as he tries to BS his way through. When confronted with the fact he is in court trying to eliminate the pre-existing conditions requirement of Obamacare, caught red-handed, he says, he intends to bring in something much better, to which Stephanopoulos replied, hey, you said a year ago that in two weeks you would unveil a great health care plan, so where is it? And when he's asked about his continuing non-plan to deal with COVID, he brings up herd mentality, by which we know he means herd immunity. Herd mentality is what his supporters suffer from, and herd immunity is equivalent to being a serial killer of your own citizens. Of course, on top of his own mistakes, due to the Jupiter square, he has also been getting steady bad numbers. Much though he tries to change the subject to law and order, Biden maintains the same lead he's had all along, and polls continue to point to COVID, the subject he desperately wants to avoid, as being more important than the possibility we're all going to be taken hostage by Antifa anarchists. Here, Jupiter is contributing to the bad effect because it comes from the information house, and in a square delivers data and information, numbers and facts, that are not favorable to him.